Hey everyone! So today I'm going to be reviewing the Louis Vuitton My Lock Me Chain Bag. I have it here in the color grayish. I had wanted this bag for a really long time. I had it bookmarked on my computer for months and months. And I finally purchased it when I went to Milan back in November. The reason why I wanted this bag was because it is a decent sized shoulder bag and I just think that the gold hardware is so beautiful and the chain strap here is adjustable. Um, you can wear it over the shoulder like this or you can just hold the chain like this and wear it crossbody. They make it super easy. The only thing is with this chain, it is a pretty decent weighted chain. It makes the bag decently heavy. I wouldn't say it's super heavy. I don't know if you've ever picked up the YSL Sunset Medium bag. Uh, that bag is really heavy. I had tried that bag on in the store and when I put it over my shoulder, I was like, oh geez, my shoulder is going to break off if I put my own stuff in it. All right, I'm exaggerating, but you know what I mean. So I wouldn't say that this bag is light and I wouldn't say that it was heavy either. So this bag has only Louis Vuitton on the buckle here which is really nice. I don't really like loud branding and logos things like that. The way you open it is just turning the lock here and you can open it. On the inside there's pink microfiber lining and it has a decent size pocket here and an inner pocket here. Because of the way this bag is, it's not really structured so you can fit a good amount of things in it. I would just keep in mind that it would make this bag really heavy. So on the back of the bag, there is a zipper pocket here and it opens up pretty big as well. So this bag um, on the bottom has no feet on it so I would keep that in mind. But I would say that it stands up pretty well. It's not like one of those bags that like flops over if you put it on the table or anything like that. And I'll show you what exactly fits inside and how I look with it standing up as well. Alright, so here's the bag. I did want to show you it standing up. Even though it doesn't have feet, it does stand up pretty nicely. It is sturdy, it won't fall over. So let's open it up. Here's the outside pocket again and the inside pocket here. It did come with this business card, I guess, of uh, where I bought it. And here I have the iPhone 13 Pro Max. It does fit really nicely in this outside pocket and you can still see that there is space out here. I have my wallet, lipstick, keys, hand sanitizer, and AirPods. And you can tell that there is still a lot of space in this bag. If you were looking for a purse organizer, I did find this one on Amazon. Let me show you the purse organizer. And I want to say that when I did take this on a uh, vacation in Milan after I bought the bag, I was wearing it. It fit like everything, like sunglasses, portable charger. I was putting all kinds of things in here and it was still uh, fitting everything nicely. So here it is with the purse organizer. When you close it, you don't see it at all from the sides. So this bag really holds a lot of things. So going to the back, here's the outside zipper and really let's see if the iPhone will fit in here. Uh, it does! It's a tight squeeze but it does fit so that really shows you how big this pocket is. Again this is the iPhone 13 Pro Max so honestly I think this would be perfect for like your passport, travel documents, anything like that that you want to keep closer to you. It's great for that and then there's LV here on the zipper as well. So that is the bag and then I'll show you what it looks like on me. So here's the bag on me. Here it is on my shoulder. I'm 5'5 five five for reference. The strap is really comfortable to wear on the shoulder. And like I said before, it's super easy to wear crossbody. Just pull the chain like that. And here over the shoulder. Because of how long the leather strap is here, it makes it really comfortable to wear. The chain doesn't dig into your body, which is nice. This. So really this bag works for any occasion, I want to say. Like, 
it's so cute. So would I recommend this handbag? I would absolutely recommend this handbag. Uh, it was actually my first luxury handbag purchase ever and I really loved my decision. Uh, when I bought it in Milan, I immediately ripped it out of the box when I got back to the Airbnb and started wearing it. So it held up perfectly fine when I was in the city for a few days. And I think it really works for any occasion because of the color and the shape of this bag. I think it is a really lovely design that will honestly last for years. Um, I really don't have any comments with this bag at all. So just let me know if you have any comments or questions. And don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching.